Welcome back from Graphic Extras. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create uh, sort of cut through designs using Photoshop shapes and a blending mode called Clear and gradients. Now, the gradients are going to be the layer in the whole design, and the custom shapes are actually going to be the ele element I'm going to use to cut through the gradient layer. Right, I'm just going to now go to Photoshop CC and I'm just going to select the gradient tool. And I'm going to create a background first. It's just going to be a very basic bright light gradient. And you can find it actually in this one. And it's the special effects, the gradient one. And then I'm going to select this one, which has got some transparency. Now, the key thing here is the transparency. I want basic transparent. I want pixels that are filled, which is that bit there and obviously zero or null or empty pixels. And I'm going to apply it to a layer. So a new layer, click OK. And just going to apply it now. Of course, the key thing here is transparency here. So, and, and they're just normal. I can just quickly apply that multiple times. And of course, I can also apply the behind, which actually applies, again, if there's actually no pixels you actually it actually applies behind thing if there's actually pixels there it doesn't so you can actually just put everything behind so instead of actually using the background layer you can actually just put them on the same layer just behind the original design okay next thing to do I'm just going to go over to the custom shape tool and I'm going to use a custom shape from a graphic extras it's one of the uh, grid design grid custom shapes there's thousands and thousands of custom shapes available on graphic extras and I'm going to use the clear option. There's a clear option. And what that does, it actually clears any pixels. So it actually returns it back to an empty pixel, or zero pixel, null pixel, whatever you want to call it. And I'm just going to use this, just apply that over there. And of course, I could apply it multiple times. And you can see now straight away, you can actually see there's the empty pixels. You can actually see cut through and you can actually see the gradient behind of course once you've done that you can actually go to I, think I could quickly show you you can actually add obviously again to those gradients I'm just gonna and again I could apply of course again I'm just gonna go to the custom shape tool and I can apply it again and of course that just empties more of the pixels it's obviously an interesting design which of course then I can go to layer layer style maybe drop shadow and click OK right anyway hope you found this uh, quick tutorial showing you the clear option which is very useful for uh, just cutting away pixels in a design it's quite a useful tool you can only use it with the pixels option you can't use it with shape or path which is a pity but Anyway, that's the, the feature of the tool. And I uh, hope you obviously enjoyed that. So you'll subscribe to the Graphic Extra channel if you would. That would be great. I'm always adding many new tutorials every couple of days. Thank you very much.